What's good, Anxious Speed Squad? If you're new here, go ahead and hit that like button because it doesn't cost you guys a dime. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, that post notification bell, so that you can know every time Anxious Speed posts a video. Good morning, guys. My God, listen. I have so much to tell you guys. <laughs> so much to tell you guys. Literally over the weekend, my patient died. So I'm currently only working part-time. Um, also... I had already signed up to do Amazon Flex, and if a lot of you, if you don't know what it is, it's just basically contract working, um, delivering the Amazon packages. So yesterday, I decided to try it out. I grabbed the shift. I really grabbed, I blind grabbed the shift. I opened it, didn't know which location it was, boom, grabbed it. Uh, and I went and worked yesterday from 1 to 6. It's supposed to be from 1 to 6. I didn't finish till 7.34. Reason I didn't finish until 7.34 is because... In the beginning, they give you a giant cart. Guys, I would have to get like the measurements so I could tell you guys how big this shit was. But it was in a giant, a big, big, big container that you roll on wheels. And there were 48 packages in the route that I selected. So uh, first thing is they say you should put them in your car according to because the app directs you everywhere. This is a very easy job. It's extremely easy. It's just um, getting into the places when you're not familiar with the area that'll get you. Literally... I had, they were like, put them in the car, going by the addresses of the night, because it takes you from place to place. The app takes you directly how you should deliver them. And the places weren't far from each other at all, five minutes at the most. But the kickoff was, you know how hard it is when you don't recognize addresses to sort the packages according to what they what he was saying? So I saw another little guy out there, and I asked him, you know, how is this an easier way to do this? He was like, no, because you if you don't know the address, I just go off names and say, honestly, I don't sort them here. I load, I separate them by what kind of packages they are, what they're packed in, and that's how I load them into my car. She's, and he says, when I get to my location, then I get go by names and look for the packages. So I, I put, I sorted them out, got through it, but some of the locations were hard to get to. There are some places in Houston that I have never seen before. There are some houses and some setups in Houston I had never heard before. So I was just so amazed with what I saw. Have you ever been somewhere your whole life and just had not seen all that was there to be seen? That's just how I felt yesterday when I was seeing all these different houses and apartment complex. And then there was one particular one. It, it took me 30 minutes to get her package to her because um, there's some houses that are built close together. That is a subdivision that's also, it's set up like an apartment complex, but they're houses. And it was hard to find out where she was. And then I could find her garage and she had a note that said, don't leave her package back there. And so of course I got to follow directions. So I had to find her front door and I couldn't find out how to get to her front door because there were no breedways like in apartments where you could cut through here and there. So I did end up finding her, but that frustrated me. And you know what happens once you get frustrated and upset, you don't move as fast as you were at first. Something else I wasn't prepared for. My charger cord that's in this car is no good. Um, it was nothing but the good Lord that held me that last hour with that 4% because considering the fact that I was running my G, the GPS the whole time through the Amazon app and I was um, having to scan the packages, take pictures of them at the door, I swear the Lord kept that 4% for me for an hour. I kept putting it back on every time I got in, but you got to take it off every time you get out because you need it. The Lord had my back. Do you hear me? that phone stayed charged it never died it let me finish till the end but at the end y'all will not fucking believe i had one package left that was not in my stuff but i think it was on my thing because it did say that i had an envelope needs to be scanned but the thing was i think the customer had canceled the item or something of that sort and it was already there so the computer read that and took it out of the route so at the end after i scanned i did 48 and it said I had 48 at the beginning, but actually I had 49 because when I finished 48, I still had that one left. So I had to go all the way back to the office and take it back because it states if you could bring it back before 10 a.m. And I'm like, no, because, of course, Thursdays, if you follow me on social media, then you know that I do. I run a personal business called Feisty Salad. And, um, you know, that kind of, that kind of, kind of takes away from my time. You know, so... I had so much going on trying to do that yesterday, but it was an experience I enjoyed. I did like the job. So if any of you guys are looking for something on the side that's flexible, you're trying to make some extra money, 
a, you can go through and apply for the Amazon Flex. I was on the waiting list for a while and they just pulled me off now. It was like the Lord know that I needed it. I don't know how that stuff kind of aligns with each other. But for the most part, it just showed up like right the week before my patient died. And I was kind of going through the background checks and the license checks and stuff like that. But it is an easy job. You just have to know your size of town or your streets and i'm not familiar with the north side and that's where i was but for the most part i enjoyed it it was very easy the app makes it very easy for you so don't say oh i can't do stuff like that i can't do stuff like that. you can that app made it so much better for me to do it i just can't even describe to you how easy that app made things like literally i think the app just really you know, I've never seen anything so well put together to where it guides you the whole time. You don't need your GPS. I really had, I didn't have to work hard. All I had to do was follow that app and scan. It's called Amazon Flex. So if you're interested or you need a little side job, go apply. You can Google Amazon Flex and then there's an app, but it's not in the Play Store that you can download from your phone to your phone. And do the application that way um you actually do a little small application it's real small like basically just your information if they're putting you on the wait list and then when they get you off that's when they ask you to do everything but that's what i came to you guys for i just wanted to put you guys on some game it's called amazon flex you can make some really good quick money and i believe it pays from 18 to 25 dollars an hour it depends on what area you're in and what all you're willing to do you guys do me a favor hit that like button on the way out hit that subscribe button that post notification bell so that you can know every time anxious feed post a video i love you guys i can do it without you guys one other thing i want to share with you if you didn't if you don't follow me on facebook then you won't know this, but I got monetized on Facebook. Finally, that was my first goal before I came to YouTube was to be monetized on Facebook on the reels. And I really thought because it was so many people doing it that I wouldn't get a chance. I finally did. So I'm going to work just as hard for them as I work for you guys. Now that I've been dedicated to it, I'm here to stay. Guys, don't don't take it for granted. Like, honestly, I want to do so much more, so much bigger things with this channel. You won't even be, when, when it all comes down and I get it all together, you guys are going to be so blown because everybody knew I already have a big mouth. I just had to find another way to use it. I love you guys. Don't forget to smack that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.